Today we're featuring the Pro 1000 DS radar uh, that we sell for $595 on our website. Uh, it comes with front and rear antennas, a remote control for selecting front and rear, locking, and putting the radar in hold. Started off, uh, you got your on off switch right here, you just turn it on, and that's also your volume control. So, um, the next you have your moving stationary switch, which allows you to select between moving mode or stationary, which we're stationary right now. Squelch, unsquelch just squelches your audio when there's no targets coming, so you don't hear all the static and everything. So, just leave that squelched. You got your test button here that shows you all your segments are working and when you release it goes to a 32 if you're in moving mode you press it and release it it'll show 32 32 okay back to stationary and then if we your lock release when you hit lock it locks whatever's in the target in the lock window but continues to watch the target speed on the remote control you have your front and rear antenna, we don't have an antenna selected, uh, installed in this car. So it's just showing AN, letting us know there's no antenna there. And then your lock is also here as well. And you have the hold button, which what that does is put the radar in hold so you're not putting out any signal. And this defeats radar detectors. So one nice thing about this radar, if you have it in hold, you can hit the lock button and take it in and out of hold as well. Just like that. So I locked someone in at 55 and I just took my radar out of hold for a split second. So that's what they call quick track feature on this. On this. Notice it says on the remote, exclusive quick track. That allows you to, to to pop an individual without setting off everybody's radar detector up and down the road. So, back out of hold. We're reading the car going away. Now that pickup truck is reading at 55. And also we're seeing that one slowing down in the middle lane. Now we're getting that car coming in the distance. It's overriding the pickup truck and we're getting him coming in here at 59 and you can listen to the audio and hear how it's clearing up that lets you know you're actually on him so I can lock him in at 59 and then continue to read targets in my target window if I want to lock in that this semi this box truck that just went by or this SUV I just lock it in like that and that locks in whatever at that instant is in the target window will, will show up in the lock window. Okay, now we're going to go to moving mode on this radar. So we're going to pull out in traffic here. And we're going to put it over in moving. So it's showing my speed in the patrol window at 30 and oncoming traffic at 52. And that's your audio, you can hear that. So it's just as simple as that. This radar is very small, just like the Stalker is. And it's got uh, smaller antennas. They're only about three inches long, about as long as the Stalker antennas, but they are a little wider, as you can see in the picture. So, uh, but they do have great range. As you can see, we're driving along here and as soon as the car comes within range it'll pick them up just about as quick as you can see them there's a car there showing up at 49 and i can put my radar in hold as well and when i bring it out of hold It shows my patrol speed and then the oncoming traffic instantly. See the double dash? That means that the rate that my speed is matched his speed perfectly. 
and so it's sewn a double dash so that um, is not to display an erroneous reading because radar all radars see your patrol speed in the target window at times so anytime your patrol speed matches perfectly the target speed you're going to get a double dash a blank screen an har for harmonic whatever is going to show you that you need to either speed up a little bit or slow down so that your patrol speed does not match the target speed That's the end of this demonstration of the Pro 1000 DS.